Okay, Tom Hamer, Paris Swimmer of the Year. That is not an easy title to win this year of all years. First of all, how do you feel? Yeah, I'm over the moon to get the title. Uh, I honestly thought Maisie could have got it because she had an incredible year. First European Championships, walked away with a world record as well as me. So it's been a crazy year for para swimming and we've all done so well. So to be stood on stood on the stage and winning the title has been pretty, spe uh, pretty special. It's been an incredible year because, as you mentioned, it's not just the guys and girls that we've known for a couple of years who have been successful. We went to Dublin and we had new members of the team going and winning medals as well. It's not... A British meet could be a European Championships, that's the sort of standard. How does that help you improve knowing that your teammates are pushing you every single step of the way? Yeah, it's really nice having knowing that there's someone behind you pushing you. Get, they want to get better, you want to get better. But it's all about the next generation. and. We, we, in, throughout sport there will always be a next generation it's so good to see them coming through the sport and uh, trying to chase you senior athletes and yeah do you feel a bit like a senior citizen around some of them yeah i'm 20 years old and i really feel like i am one of the senior athletes but i've been to paralympics i've been to two commonwealths and a few europeans so i know the competitions really well and i've got that experience so it's really nice to show that to them kids and to the young ones who are doing so well and uh, pass that knowledge on to them and see them on the world stage as well. You seem to be really enjoying your swimming at the moment. Is it because you, you feel very comfortable in your environment, you know what to expect, it's just all about you now? Yeah, I'm really comfortable at the minute, yeah. I'm at the National Performance Centre in Manchester and it's going really well, working with my coach Graham Smith and Lauren. So we've just got a plan together for next year and the year after then. Tokyo will be at our doorsteps then, so it is going to be an interesting two years leading up to that, definitely. A massive year next year as well with the Worlds in Malaysia, I think, as well. So potentially some more air miles on the clock for you. How much are you looking forward to next year, having had such a great 2018? Yeah, this year we're in Australia, next year we're in Malaysia, so it, it's a bit, lot of air miles, but it'd be really nice to go out there and hopefully my family will be able to come out and support me at the World Championships. So, yeah, it's good. And uh, World Championships two years ago got cancelled due to an earthquake in Mexico, so I missed that. So it'd be good to have this opportunity in Malaysia. We can't wait to watch you. Congratulations on an amazing year. Thank you.